So we discussed platforms now, and, and one of the big features in platforms is complete visibility of all actors and all translations, uh, transactions. So there's a ton of data that's being collected. You're completely visible. Everything you do is completely visible. And what we have seen is that people become a little bit uneasy. Regulators become uneasy. And that means we as organizations have to think a little bit harder on, on what do we do with consumer privacy and with all the data and so on. There's sort of a new concept coming on that's called corporate digital responsibility. And that really has to do is with that are we responsible and are we understanding sort of the four stages of data and technology. And the first one is sort of creation of technology and capture of data. And I mean, we talk about privacy, but capture of data, I can capture a ton of data about you without you do not knowing. Yes, I use biometrics, I use observe, I look at it, you know, I can pull, scrape data from your Facebook and WeChat and everything. So it's how I capture data. The second is what do I do with this data? So I, what variables do I build? So if I'm a life insurance, I can try and build data on how healthy are you? How healthy is your lifestyle? Yeah? How much do you move? Yeah, well, what, so I can try to pull data from Facebook and other things. So I, I, can, have a, uh, um, I, I can have a variable called your healthiness, your lifestyle choices. I can build a, uh, what they do in credit scoring uh, all over the world is I build a model about you, how financially risky you are. Right? So uh, what's, your, what's your credit score? So first is capture. The second is I build variables with this. The third stage is really I make decisions based on it. So I have an AI that says, do I give you this loan? Yes or no? And uh, if I give you this loan, at what interest rate? Uh, given your riskiness. So you can see all these ethical questions. In the US, there were a ton of, of issues about discrimination. If you live in a neighborhood where, where somebody got bankrupt, then your zip code shows that you're in a neighborhood where somebody got bankrupt, your credit score drops in these models. <laughs> right? Is that ethical? Yeah. And the last one is really the retirement of those data. Uh, the right to be forgotten, right? I mean, how long currently companies keep data forever? So how long should you keep this data? So I think there are a lot of uh, decisions, uh, a lot of issues around uh, ethics here. I can build algorithms to make decisions on who to hire, who to fire, who to promote, who to give a pay rise without human judgment, right? And I think this is sort of where many people feel still uneasy. And there's even something called algorithm aversion. If people make the decision, customers, employees are a lot more forgiving than if an AI makes a decision. And I think these are some of the things at least the big companies have to think about carefully. So this is the last part on, on robotics, AI, and platforms, because this is all data and algorithm driven.